the, the infamous MGTOW guys show up and say, with their famous line of, is the juice worth the squeeze? How do you answer this one? Uh, I mean, yeah. Um, like, I got it all on camera um, with when I was in Venice Beach. So I was walking up to random people, didn't know anybody, um, invited all those girls back to my hotel room. I got laid. Um, we have we have a lot of it. We actually have it on camera where I'm like just talking to all of them. We're like talking about sex. We're like we're doing like three way kisses and stuff. Just you know, having a good time. Um, yeah, I, I'd say juice is heavily worth the squeeze. That was a very fun night. And literally, just I walked on the beach for a um, beach beach and sidewalk for two hours to get that. Like, yeah, absolutely. And I, and I would say that like if it, if because guys will be like, especially McTag guys will be like, well. I could just get a sex doll or hire a prostitute, but there's something about, I mean, I bet you. Oh, they're comparing damn, it to that. Is that what right. they're comparing it to? I think they're, they, yeah, it's kind of like, yeah. Cause I, I think that the, the just, I mean, you probably felt pretty damn good from a confidence level of like oh, yeah. having actually yeah. like that alone is, is, is to me, it makes it worth it. Uh, but you know, I don't know, like overcoming your fears, like realizing that you're the guy that can actually do this. Mm -hmm. To me, that's that's always going to be worth the squeeze. But absolutely, you know, when I started out, I was like, like I said, nervous, and then after I did it, I was like feeling really good about myself. Um, I had an awesome night that you know anybody, if they heard about it, would have just been amazed that you know looking at it as I was on Friday, then how I ended up Sunday night, it was like a night and day difference, dude. I was like a completely, completely new person, but also the same person as well too. Um, and uh, yeah, are people really saying that like? you know, meeting a girl, having her like you and then sleeping with her is like just as good as hiring a prostitute. Like I think, or, or a sex doll. This is, Oh, like, or, or a sex doll. Okay. Right. <laughs> it's, this is, that's um, that's yeah, dude, I think I, I like I've, I've paid for sex before. I've probably paid for it like four times in my life. Um, I, I would rather sleep with a woman who was like below average in attractiveness I would get more enjoyment from that knowing that she actually liked me than to sleep with someone who was paid. Unless yeah. I guess the woman who was paid was like really retardedly good or something like that. <laughs> but yeah. No, I don't, uh, I, I don't think you get a whole lot of uh, in, enjoyment out of that. So we got a couple of good ones here. I think this one, I was going to ask you about this as well, because this is something that guys struggle with. This is kind of like step two. Uh -huh. Is here once you approach how do you create attraction and not make it boring friendly conversation so how do you build that like sexual tension instead of it being you know the sure. interview questions and stuff sure sure so um 